to create this design you need to add a UV sphere and I will go with the 24 segment and 12 rings then turn on the wireframe then go to the edit mode select this top word and turn on the proportional editing and move these words along the z-axis then select these top faces and delete them then select these edge loops and use the set flow on them to maintain the good edge flow then select everything and then use the right click poke faces then use the tries to chords then select these edges and control x to dissolve them select these horizontal edges and dissolve them dissolve the edges at the bottom side also like this then you need to add a decimate modifier and check this unsubdivide and iteration should be 2 then you need to apply the modifier go to the edit mode select these faces and use the insert operation and give the proper thickness 0 0.05 then select these faces and use the insert operation and give same thickness then here you need to add vertex like this and select these words and then move them along the z-axis like this and then you can select these faces and use the insert operation then select everything and merge by distance now you need to select the vertex like this you can see the pattern in which I am going to select this vertex so I can achieve that design and then change the transform pivot point to 3D cursor and scale along the x and y axis and now select these words you can see and scale them along the x and y axis now select these words and scale them along the x and y axis and now these words and scale them along the x and y axis then use the knife tool and create straight cut like this so we can repeat that design then take the symmetry then select these faces and delete them delete this bottom faces take the symmetry delete unwanted faces like this now rotate this design apply the rotation then add the sub modifier and shear smooth it now we will create a topology for it you need to add two two loop cuts like this then select these center edges and dissolve them then you need to add loop cuts like this these are the supportive loop cuts to maintain the form then dissolve this edge loop in this way add supportive loop cuts and dissolve unwanted edges then take the symmetry along the x-axis then you can use the knife tool and complete those edge loops in this way so you can get right compass topology then add more loop cuts like this then create a cut along the x-axis then take the symmetry I'm just trying to maintain the form of that design so I'm creating right topology for it you can see the process here after creating right topology you will get this kind of design then dissolve this center edges and delete this bottom faces and top faces then shift to duplicate it and rotate it into 45 degree angle and complete that design
then merge the words by distance. So you will get this kind of design. Then select these center edges which are destroying the topology and dissolve them. This is very important step you need to perform. Now you can see the shading and the form of the model. Then select the stop edge loop and use the loop tool circle option. Then dissolve some edges like this. Then select these words and merge them at the center in this way. And here I am recreating the topology for that top part. You need to observe the process carefully. Then take the symmetry and now you can see I'm getting proper loop structure. Then select the stop each loop and press F to fill the gap and then add bevel on it. Then select the stop face then use the grid fill add there to create right topology. And same thing you need to repeat at the bottom side also. Select this each loop, press F to fill the gap, use the insert operation, delete face and then use the grid fill. You can do the multiple variations of this design with more topology, with more vertex count at the initial stage. And there you go. In this way, you can create this kind of design. You can see the form of the model. You can see the topology. You can see the details. So that's it for today. Thanks for watching. If you like this tutorial, then hit that like button and subscribe to YouTube channel. Bye bye. So next video, take care.